kid gets knocked out in front of his crush. It's self-explanatory. So honestly, let's see what they do to make this royally f Stay low What in the threesome? Oh shit, she got two black up in this car. God damn, man. The band, hey, Ben, step correct, my G. From the turmoil. Yo! On tomorrow's teachings. Is that, 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 you need to step off or I'm gonna crash out, cuz. Oh, it's about to go down. Hey, yo! Once a match is made, the couple engages Boy. in a dance of courtship with the male grasping the female in a tight embrace known as amplexus. In this intimate position, they may stay locked together for- What in the threesome? God damn, is that like three frogs or four? What the f- Even days, as the female lays her- Happy anniversary, baby! Ali? Oh! I didn't know you were coming so early! I wanted to surprise you. Your dad, I mean. Uh, that reminds me. I got something for you. Stay here. What he got? Close your eyes. No! <laughs> Shut up! You did not! Apple headphones? Which ones are those? I've never seen those before. I know you wanted it. Yeah, that's Wait, that's what does it say? <laughs> I've never seen those! Why is he calling you? He's been trying to get back with me, but I've told him over and over again that we're done and he just doesn't listen. <laughs> Why don't you just block him? I have. And then he started calling me from other people's phones. Oh, He's shit. Crazy. Let me talk to him. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What? No. Let me talk to him. Give me the phone. Don't make things worse, Ben. Ben. Okay, I won't. Let me talk to him. And don't, don't turn up, Ben, you. please. Yo, man. Oh shit, she got two black niggas up in this car? God damn, man! The ben, hey, Ben, step correct, my G. Step correct, it might get crazy, I can't lie to you. I don't know who are you, but you need to stop calling Ali. Yo, who the heck are you, bro? I'm a boyfriend. I'm telling you to stop calling Ali, okay? You don't know who you're talking to. Ali's mine. And you need to step off or I'm finna crash out, cuz. Like, I'm gonna pull up on you now. What? <laughs> Damn. Mm -hmm. He's saying he's gonna come up, but he doesn't know where exactly I live. Um, my AirTag? I've never had AirTag configured on any of my devices. I don't even know how to make it work. But it sounds like a massive liability, man. I don't need someone knowing where I am at all times. <laughs> That's too much. That's too deep. But he's big. And scary. I know how to fight. I'm gonna knock him down. Okay? Babe, no, you're not fighting him. I am. Yes, I am. I wanna protect you. Yo, whoop his ass in. You got this. You got this. You, you Ali's new boyfriend? He just pulled up like that, like in the front gate, front door, no entry? I mean, no security? God damn. Oh. oh. So this is who you want to be with? Some little boy that can't protect you? I love you, Ali. More than anything. I know we've had our rough times, but I don't care. Ain't no way. I'll do anything to make this work. You're mine. And you always will be. Yo! Oh, man. That's rough. That's rough. That's rough. God damn. Nah, not the tears in the crotch area. Hey, 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 hey. Man, they look like you got damn c stains on, 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 on the damn, on the jeans, man. <coughs> on the jeans, like nut stains. Feeling the emptiness gnawing at his heart. Nah, your his girl got taken. Him, her eyes full of pity as she turned away after seeing him beaten. He kept watching the Snapchat story. Not the Snapchat. He displayed his defeat. Each video, <laughs> Of his pain and isolation. <laughs> Bro got knocked out by a target combo, man. That wasn't even no pretzel input. That was a target combo. X, X, X. KO. Perfect. The only way Ben could feel anything close to love was by watching romantic movies like The Notebook. Yo, Ben. 
Damn. Hey, I'm talking to you, punk. What do you want? Well, I just wanted to show you this. No. Yes. See this. Is that Ali? Yeah, bro. She told me how small you were. Boy, I ain't gonna lie to you. If somebody ever show you a video of the girl you were just dating getting smashed by them, it's up. It's up. You just might have to get aggressive, man. You just might have to box. I can't lie to you, man. You're gonna have to fight that nigga. There's no way you're walking away. You're gonna have to fight that nigga. And seeing and, and hearing it sound like she enjoying it that much, we gonna have to fight, man. <laughs> Unfortunately, it is what it is. It's the nature of man. You see and hear that shit, it's up, my nigga. It's up on me. That or you go home and you be severely depressed. Ooh. Shorty likes the big ones. This guy has a small wiener and his mother's got cancer. Talk about bad luck. You didn't think I knew? Ali told me everything. Cancer, disgusting. What the fuck? Poor people have cancer. Let's go, bro. Couldn't be me, poor bitch. <laughs> ben sat alone, lost in thought, questioning himself, wondering why he was the way he was. Don't do it, Ben. Wishing he had the courage to stand up to the bullies who tormented him. Don't do it. And he couldn't face another day at school. Oh, Instead, no. He wandered into the wilderness. As he walked, he spotted a small frog by the edge of a stream. No. Yes. In his desperation and confusion. What the fuck? He thought perhaps this strange encounter could offer some form of release from the turmoil inside. Yo! His thoughts grew darker, clouded what the by fuck? his desire to feel anything different. What the, the fuck? Pain that consumed him. Ben walked into his room, feeling the weight of his steps. The light was dim, and everything seemed the same. Now, what they got going on, man? Bro got top from a frog? Correct. Nah, man. Dome from a frog is diabolical work, man. Now, that takes some creativity. I don't know who came up with this script, but that dude need to nut. Whoever it is, man, they need to nut immediately. Except for a note lying on his bed. It stood out against the rumpled sheets. Hold on. I feel like I need to read it because they probably won't read it. <clears throat> There's a lot of blur. I know this is... What the fuck is that world? I know this is going to be hard to understand, but I need you to wait. Ben, I know this is going to Oh, <laughs> my bad. They do eventually read it, but I think she says she's not his mom. To be hard to understand, but I need you to know that I've always loved you and your mom, but I'm sorry, I'm leaving. Your mom has cancer and is probably going to die soon. What? Also, I met a nice girl at Hong Kong in TJ. We're getting married. Maybe I'll see you someday when you're all grown up. <laughs> Good what? My son. Attached to the note were two books. A thick manual on karate. Not karate and Arnold. And a bodybuilding guide by Arnold Schwarzenegger. Ben realized his dad must have left. It's time to train, bro. He found himself absorbed in the pages. As he read for hours, a spark lit within him. Okay. Maybe with enough practice, he could learn to defend himself. Oh, we getting swole. You're goddamn right. Ben threw himself into training with determination. He hit the heavy bag. Oh, until his shit. Knuckles ached. Each day, he pushed himself harder. After months of hard training, okay, ben, ben finally saw the results. The time spent hitting the bag, running, and shadow boxing had paid off. Okay, Ben, not the wangs, my boy. I gotta play the Falcon sound effect right there. God damn, he got the wangs. Yo. Oh, oh shit. Shit, I'm down. You already know. You already know. Ben, is that you? <laughs> Are you working out? You? Can you please give my bag back? We get an instant bite back? <laughs> Pack her up. Get this girl out of here. Is this karate? 
Are you trying to learn how to fight so you can get your revenge back on me? No. Come on, give my bag back. Well, even if you could learn how to fight, I bet you wouldn't even be able to land a hit on now, me. Now, pack him up. Pack him up. Too slow, too chunky, and too small. Ian lunged forward with a left hook aimed straight at Ben's That's head. That's the worst but punch. Ben's time seemed to slow down. He felt a calmness wash over him. Ultra instinct? Oh, shit. Just how much his training had sharpened his reflexes. And Ben knew in that moment he was ready to take on this fight with ease. Oh! They killed him! My hero! Nani? Yeah, we'll eat later or something. <laughs> Hold on now. Firstly, let's address the way he died. That scream was ridiculous, man. Bro, straight up died like a MK2 fighter, man. <laughs> this girl gotta go. Her role in this story is sickening. What? And he just took her back like that? Bro, have some spine, man. All that fitness, all them gains, and you didn't work on your spine? Come on, man. Wait. What is it? Why am I taking home, taking you home with me? And I know you're leaving Ian right the way you left me. Babe, when I saw you get beat up, it made me feel icky. Nah. But then I saw you beat up Ian, and it made me more attracted to you. I mean, that's just how us girls are. But that's not how things work. If you love me, you have been with me the whole time. Okay. You know how hard it was the whole couple of months? Huh? My mom is in the dead bed with cancer. And remember the video too when her cheeks was getting demolished. Remember that shit. And my dad, he just left us and marrying a new bitch. And guess what? I have fucking herpes with a fucking frog. So screw you. Oh shit! Ben fully embraced his new persona. The ultimate Sigma male. Drawing inspiration from figures like Andrew Tate. Wait, what the he fuck? Vowed never to be mistreated by anyone again. Especially not by a woman, ready to face whatever came his way without fear or doubt. What's up, guys? This is Oliver. Oliver, not now. I, I'm, I'm processing the video. What the fuck just happened, man? Oh my god, this video was so random. This video was it, it, it blew my cerebral region. I, I don't even know if my brain can exist anymore. What? Bro did a full on fatality, man. Like uppercut straight into the front grill of the, of the damn truck, man. Nah, that was crazy. Honestly, I understand the message that was conveyed, but the way they went about it, it, it turned my brain into a pretzel, man. We had damn bro trying to fight for his girl. She leaving him because he lost the fight. She got her cheeks clapped. Cheeks, not cheeks. She got her cheeks clapped up. His old man left to go to Hong Kong to smash some cheeks. Left him the book. Like, bro, mom died from cancer. It, 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 there, bruh. <laughs> the frog scene we didn't even talk about the frog scene getting domed from a frog is devious work my boy i've never even considered something like that what the fuck how how does it even work like you know what i'm saying because a, a frog got a, a small mouth man so i don't know i i, I don't even want to know in fact i'm done listen this video was interesting in typical fashion hella fucked up but not as racist as usual so you know what this wasn't it wasn't too bad i can understand the message and it's it, it's a bit more light on the palette which i can appreciate but hey man if y'all are enjoying these reactions tune in you know what your boy's doing man we watching videos nothing nothing too crazy man but pull up hit that sub button man hit the goddamn sub button i'm desperate at this point i'm begging for some crumbs man hit the damn sub button